I've just been going through my cabinets, listening to all the pills I probably should have thrown out long ago, but have now discovered maybe they might be a little bit useful as noisemakers for an ASMR video. Thinking about all the medications that have been brought into use in the world and how much they owe to you, I just want to say how much I appreciate you. You know, I've I've been starting to think that perhaps you might have been going through a little bit of a rough patch. Sometimes proper double-blind placebo-controlled procedures may not have been followed for the last few decades, and you might be feeling a little neglected, a little bit, perhaps underappreciated, and I just wanted to say you're probably the most versatile well used important medical thing that's ever been used. You're responsible for all the successful life saving, life enhancing drugs that have ever been brought to market. Where would they be without double blind placebo controlled trials where the person administering the drug doesn't know what they're giving, the one getting it doesn't know what they're getting. They know they might be on the drug being tested or viewed placebo. And that is essential to the integrity of the testing system. We couldn't have that without you. All the successful medicines that have been developed are there because of you. And all the ones that shouldn't have been brought to market were brought there in spite of you. Think of all the times a drug company just tested and tested and tested multiple times. Didn't get any results that exceeded you until once in a while maybe they got lucky. And then they published those results and it suppressed all the others. Or all the times when someone might have been tested and they found that the drug being tested was so awful, gave people so many side effects and hurt them in so many different ways that the people on the trial quickly realized that they weren't taking you the placebo and the blindness of the trial was destroyed because everybody knew what drug they were getting and yet there have been times when the companies have just gone ahead and put out those drugs anyway even though they weren't properly tested and subjected the whole population to an improper test because it's not even experimental if people know what drug they're getting well, you know, you are far better than so many of the drugs that have been tested. Even some of the ones that have gotten out there when people are panicked and they say, well, we're just going to ignore proper testing procedures because it's such an emergency and we got to get medicines out there. And it turns out the medicines that get out there are just causing the very symptoms they're meant to cure. Well, I don't know. I don't know how you, you manage. I don't know how you, well, of course, I don't know how you do anything because you're a placebo. That's the whole thing. But, wow, you must feel like taking yourself sometimes. It must be so hard. And yet, you keep on. Saving millions of lives, inspiring anyone who wants to, in some way, have a triumph of mind over matter. You know, they're saying now that some supposed performance enhancing drugs aren't really performance enhancing at all they're just you they're placebos and so many drugs that people say are working are really just you in disguise because they haven't been properly blindly placebo controlled tested there's all of those medicines out there that are taking the credit for what you've done they're so mysterious so powerful. There are people who think there are actually some real effects that come from just believing that something will work. So mysterious, so intriguing. And you're a superhero, aren't you? Really, that's what a superhero is. Somebody who is in disguise, saves people behind the scenes, has to maintain a plausible deniability as to who it really is. That's, and you even got the name for it. It's so operatic, so musical. Placebo, a mighty placebo. <laughs> it's just, and yet, is there really a superhero named placebo that we recognize? Oh, not that I know of. Maybe I'm guilty there too. But 
I just wanted to say maybe you've had a, a tough few decades here, but I recognize you. I could say, hypothesize with a reasonable hope of scientific accuracy that no one has ever done so much for so many by doing so little. Thank you.